Hello guys, today I'm here with new tutorial, and in this video I'm gonna show how to dual boot Mac OS Big Sur, with pre-installed Windows 10. So before starting, if you haven't subscribed to our channel, then please go and subscribe to our channel and stay connected for latest updates. So guys let's start. For this purpose you will require, Mac OS Big Sur installer, a command file for creating bootable USB, open cork configurator, for mounting EFI partitions, and EFI preset according to your hardware. To create EFI for yourself, follow the guide for my button, and also an USB with minimum 16GB is required for the purpose. So the very first step is to create macOS bootable USB. For that plug your USB, and as you can see the USB appeared here. Open Disk Utility and erase the USB with following parameters. Click on done and close disk utility, open the command file, and copy the whole command, and paste it to terminal and press enter key, enter your password and confirm origin of the USB. And now the USB is being created. USB has been created successfully, quit terminal, open open core configurator, and mount the EFI partition of USB, quit open core configurator, now copy EFI folder, and paste it to the EFI partition of USB, close the folder, copy open core configurator, and paste it to USB, eject the EFI partition and USB as well. And now, we're ready to install. Power on your PC and boot to BIOS. Load the BIOS defaults and exit the BIOS saving changes. Your PC will restart. Boot back to BIOS. Now, change the following settings. Now exit BIOS saving changes. Your PC will restart. Boot to Windows 10. Now here, open disk management. Select the C partition and shrink the volume. Enter the amount of space you want to shrink, and then click on shrink. And now, create new partition with the shrink space. After creating the partition, close disk management, and restart your PC. Plug Big Sur bootable USB and boot to boot menu. Select the USB followed by the UEFI prefix, and press enter to boot. Select install Mac OS Big Sur and press enter to boot. Select disk utility, and click on continue. Click on view, and select show all devices. Now select the volume, previously created on Windows 10, and erase the partition with following parameters. Click on done and close disk utility, now select install macOS and click on continue, and continue with the setup. Select Macintosh HD and click on Continue. And now, Mac OS Big Sur is being installed. And guys, during this process your PC will restart several times, so don't worry about that.
After restart, boot your PC to boot menu. Select the USB followed by the UEFI prefix, and press enter to boot. Keep in mind to always boot from USB, until installation is completed. In later part of this video, it will be fixed. And wow, we booted to Big Sur installer setup screen. Continue with the setup. Continue with keyboard setup. Now, copy Open Core Configurator to your desktop, open Open Core Configurator, and mount the EFI partition of system drive and USB as well. Quit Open Core Configurator. Now, copy OC folder from the EFI folder, from the EFI partition of USB, and paste it to EFI folder, in EFI partition of system drive. Now, open the Microsoft folder, and then boot folder and change the name of the file. Close the folder and restart your PC. Eject the USB, and PC will directly boot to Open Core Boot Picker, boot to Mac. Now, mount the EFI partition of system drive, and change the file name to its original name. Close the folder and restart your PC, and boot to boot menu. In boot menu, change the first boot sequence to system drive with prefix UEFI OS and save the configuration your PC will restart and boot to open core boot picker so 
Windows has been booted successfully. Let's check the system specification. And now, we'll do the same for Mac OS. Here, we have successfully booted to Mac OS. Now, let's check that everything is working or not. Audio and the audio hotkeys works perfectly. Ethernet is not available as internet is currently down. Now, let's check the system specification. So finally, we have successfully installed macOS Big Sur, along with pre-installed Windows 10. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, if you have any question, just comment down below, thanks for watching and don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe, and for more updates stay connected and have a great day.